All right, what's going on everyone? It is Greg here, OMG Machines. Now today we're going to be covering how to do local keyword research. A lot of local keywords get a whole lot less searches than some affiliate terms, so it can be tougher to do, to do the keyword research, but I got a big trick that I use for local keywords. Now you know the deal. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell so you get future videos. But right now, we're going to jump into this local keyword research trick. All right, so the thing with local is for a lot of local keywords, you're going to get a lot less searches, so a lot of the keywords won't show up in keyword tools. So we have to approach it a little differently than we did with the affiliate version. So let me give you an example. I live in a city or a town called Landenburg, okay? So it's Landenburg, PA. If I'm looking for, let's say, a plumber, okay, or... You know, I get a I get a client that's in Landenburg and he's a plumber. Now the obvious keywords, we start with the obvious keywords, remember, stuff like Landenburg plumber, Landenburg plumbers, plumbers in Landenburg, stuff like that is very obvious. But if we don't know the niche, then we need to dig deeper. And usually the way as I showed in the affiliate video for keyword research, we analyze the competition. But the problem with this is that with local, the searches are so small that you may not get any a, any suggestions. So here's what I mean. So if we bring this up, here's the top guy in Landenburg, you know, that's a, a real business. And let's go to the, the organic keywords. And you see all the stuff he's ranking for to get his traffic is just the brand name. So we get no keyword ideas. So, you know, people come to me and they say, well, I did my keyword research, I analyzed the competition, I'm not really getting any suggestions because there's since Landberg PA plumber and stuff like that supposedly get no searches and that's another thing just because a keyword tool says it doesn't get searches doesn't mean anything it gets searches all right so start with those types of keywords even if it says no searches they get searches I actually think I found these guys and use them for my home because I searched that term but what we're going to do to get different ideas is we're going to search a larger city all right so let's go to Los Angeles plumber and we're going to use their keywords to drive ours especially if it's a niche you don't know you know if it's if it's a niche you're unfamiliar with even if it is a niche you know you can get a lot of ideas by analyzing competition in a bigger city so let's go and look at the first main company ranking it's this company right here where it's plumbing and let's throw them in the keyword tool all right, bam, so we got a lot more organic traffic, so we're probably gonna get a lot better keywords instead of just the name of the company. So when I go to organic keywords, boom, what do we got here? We got some really good stuff. 24-hour plumber city, emergency plumber city, um, let's see, plumbing services city, plumbers in city, we already know that one, uh, city plumber, 24-hour plumber city, let's see, what else? Commercial plumbing city. So there's a, there's another big one. Um, let's see what else. Emergency plumber city. All right, but we got some good ideas there. Okay, we got plumbing company. We got plumbing services. We got 24 hour plumber. We got emergency plumber. Those are all really good stuff that I probably would not have thought of. Okay, and there's another thing I use by the way to make this easy. It's called, I always go into Google and I do combine keywords. And there's this merge keywords dot or merge words dot com tool, and you can do stuff like just to make a, a quick keyword list if you want. Emergency plumber, you know, 24 hour, uh, you know, plumbing company, plumbing services, plumber, plumbers, stuff like that, and then just put your city here. And then bam, merge, and you got all your keywords right there. So it's an easy way to build keywords. And then I'll copy those and do, you know, city plus state, merge those, then there's those six. And then, of course, you can copy these, put them on this side, put your city on this side, and then bam, get all those versions. Okay? So that's just an easy way, by the way, to build your keyword list. But yeah, this is a great way to do keyword research for local, especially for a lot of you who get clients that are smaller or in smaller cities, where when you go and analyze the competition, all you see is like city, like city name, or you just see like the big keyword, like plumber city, city plumber. If you go and analyze the biggest cities in America, like Los Angeles, New York, and you know, so just any of the top 10, you'll find a ton of other stuff. You know, uh, again, here we got 24 hour emergency, 
plumbing services, plumbing company, and then there was a few more in there. So commercial plumbing. So we got a whole bunch more there. Then we can implement that for our smaller city, all right? And none of those are going to show searches for that smaller city, but they still get searches. I don't care what the keywords tool says. If they're in here for larger cities, they're being used for smaller cities, not as much, but they're still being used. And that's a great place to start for keyword research for local, and that's how I do it. All right, so hopefully you all enjoyed this trick today. A great way to get keyword research done for local, kind of going outside the box a little bit. Hopefully you all like this video. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you on the next one.